Welcome back guys, today we're going to be looking at the Red Paws R011 FPV drone. Now this is probably the best FPV drone for indoor flying that I've ever seen. Um, and that's for a number of reasons. So firstly this is the box, you know you get the FPV goggles, you get the transmitter and you get the drone. All in one lovely box. Now we're going to, first we're going to talk about the actual drone itself. The drone is, as you can see, fairly small. It's very small in fact. So this grid here is one centimeter uh, cubes. So if I just put it in the middle there, you can see it's about four centimeters by four centimeters, which is tiny. So a few things you should notice about this. Firstly, I've changed the case to a see-through case because I had to replace the camera. I've pulled the, uh, the antennae here through the case so it gives a better reception. And I've put electrical tape around the camera antennae so that when it crashes, and it does, uh, it's not going to damage the camera too much. I've also had to tape this because um, I crashed it a lot and uh, this was a, the simplest fix I could find. But apart from that, you know, I've crashed this thousands of times, it still flies and it still flies just as well as it does as it did when I first got it. And it's just because it's super durable, it's super effective and as I said it's the best budget drone you can get for FPV flying. Now what you get in the box is you get the, the the drone itself here, you get a battery, it only comes with one by the way, one battery, um, you get the USB charger which is in another box I think, and you get the transmitter here. You also get the FPV goggles which as you'll notice are quite small as well. They're about, let's put them on the grid, they're about six centimetres by seven centimetres and um, yeah they're very comfortable, very easy to use. They actually and this is interesting, this is going to be another video, they give a better picture and a more smooth res uh, responsive picture than the Crazy Pony goggles which double the price as well as a couple of other brands as well. These are very good and it's almost worth getting this package just to get these goggles but that's another point anyway. So you put the battery in, you, you hook it up and uh, what I'm going to do is just turn it on, the battery's, I think it's out of battery actually but it's okay. I'm just going to talk about the controller now. So the transmitter is very different to the normal type of transmitter which is quite hard to grip. This has got serrated edges on the thumbsticks so you can always make sure you're in control. And it's just easy to use, it's fairly small. Nothing really to say about this other than to get a longer range what you can do is actually pull this wire through the casing and that about that doubles or triples your range. That means you can fly all around the house as you'll see uh, now, I'll show you a video. But other than that, it's just a great drone. It's just very easy to use, very uh, strong, you know, it survives a lot of crashes and uh, yeah, gets about a three to four minute flight time. Uh, it takes about 20 to 25 minutes to charge the batteries and I would advise using this, uh, a USB charger like this, so that when you have say six of these batteries, you can charge them all at the same time from a USB and a green LED light will come on to show you they're charging and it'll go off to show you that they're fully charged that's going to mean that you can pretty much fly non-stop. You know, you can charge six batteries at a time, then you could even get another one of these and charge another six while you're flying those six. So highly recommend to get one of these. There'll be a link in the description. And that's pretty much it. Yeah, the oh. only thing I would say is to get more range, okay? Obviously pull the wire here through the casing of the transmitter, but also pull this wire through the casing of the drone. And that's just going to make your distance, your range, about double to triple what it is when it comes out of the box. And that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't actually got one of these drones yet, you can find a good uh, price in the description below. And I'll see you in the next video.